Hi there and welcome to my channel. So in last week's video I made a post about doing EC testing on my Crack Key hydroponics here and we did some adjusting to the cucumbers and to the tomatoes and I was hoping that it was going to help my cucumber here that is so sad. So I just wanted to show you kind of what it looks like up close. As you can see it seems like anytime there is a cucumber coming it's looking good and then it just starts to shrivel up and die. I keep getting these new pretty blooms but nothing seems to stick except ta-da! I got one healthy cucumber. Check it out. It's just crazy. I don't understand why one just took off. It's growing every day. It's just about ready to harvest. So I thought maybe I had fixed the problem, but any other cucumber that's starting doesn't seem to be taking off like this one did. So I just don't know. I, I really think that it could be the variety of seed that I used. I had to throw away my other Diva cucumber because it completely died after I tried to adjust the water. But I have just ordered some new varieties of seeds from West Coast Seeds that I'm going to test out. I know one was Socrates that I had grown last year and had lots of success with. So I ordered some more seeds and the other variety, the name I can't remember, I'll put it up on the screen, but it had a good review as being a good one to grow in the Cracky Method. So I'm going to try again. We're not going to give up. There's still a couple months of winter left here and time to try to grow some cucumbers indoors. My husband has been patiently waiting for cucumbers. He loves to eat cucumbers and I've really been disappointing him this winter, not getting any so far, but he should be able to enjoy this one in another day or two. So I just wanted to also show you something else that's going on here. I've got a cantaloupe coming. I've been trying to keep it fairly pruned so it doesn't get too many shoots going. It's been blooming like crazy, but so far all of these blooms seem to be males. I don't see that any of them look like they have a little bit of you know fruit developing at the end so I think I'm gonna have to do some pollination with these to to get them to grow but so far unless somebody corrects me these all seem to be male flowers so far so hopefully some female flowers show up and I can try pollinating them and we can get some cantaloupe fruit going my other tomato plants doing good here I got lots of fruit coming these seem to be growing a little bit every day, so I'm hoping I can get some nice sized tomatoes here that will be good for slicing and sandwiches. And my sun gold cherry just keeps going here. It's like a, a jungle. I have to keep just trimming it down, but every few days I'm getting a few little sun gold cherries. So I did find another variety of a parsnocarpic cucumber seed. This was called the quarantine quarantine not sure so I've been trying to get it sprouting here in my cracky container as you can see it's starting to shoot out a little sprout so once it gets a little further along I will set up this container in the cracky method fill it full of nutrient water and the roots will just grow right into the water so it'll be able to just keep growing right in this container and we'll see how that goes so like I said we still have a few more cold months of winter left so I'm going to keep trying to grow some things in my grow tent here for the next couple months but soon it's going to be time to get those seeds going for the outdoor garden so it's going to get very busy. So I hope you enjoyed watching this video. Please don't forget to hit that like button, leave a comment and if you haven't already done so please subscribe to my channel so you don't miss out on future videos. Thanks for watching.